Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to World of Warcraft. If it can be done in a raid group, that would be fan schmastic. It would be absolutely awesome, because then we will all be able to participate, anybody that wants to. But, uh, yeah, this is the idea, is at least four of you and myself will be able to end up with this mount, because Sen has gone and bought all of these abyssal fragments. Um, if we can do it better than that, then ideal, that, that would be great. Um... I will look it up, but uh, yeah, that, that, that's what we've got. That's, what, that's what's coming up to celebrate turning level 120. Now, next up, I want to go this one. We have earned Leaping Vein Seeker. My goodness me, that thing looks hideous. That thing looks absolutely disgustingly hideous. Right, I need to go there and also to unusable and I want to check all like that. And now I want to go leaping there. And naturally I want to set that as one of my favourites. And then we're going to jump onto this bad boy. Look at this thing! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, this thing is absolutely awful. This is genuinely one of the most disgusting and hideous looking mounts that I've ever ridden. And it is... Lovely. Uh, that, uh, look at it. Look at the blood dripping from it. That's not blood. It is. It's sort of blood and poison and pus oozing from its fangs. That thing is just gruesome. I know. I do want one. Do you not have one? No. I gave it to you. I thought you had two. I thought you, no. I thought you had one yourself first. <gasps> that's true love, no. ladies and gentlemen. She gave that to me for my birthday present. True love! Okay, that's fantastic. But, so, yeah. Anyway... We have that mount that she's sat on that we will be able to earn for some people in the guild at least. Like, unfortunately, we may only be able to do just four of you. Um, I am so... Googling it. Oh, okay. We we've got someone hot on the case right now. So while she's doing that, while she's busy doing her Google Foo, uh, we are going to go over here. We're not going to bother going back to the city just yet. I'm going to turn in the quest first because I normally will go straight back to the city first and... Very quickly do the auction house and do the stuff on the boat and stuff like that. We'll do that a little bit later, I think. We've still got room to get more loot. You need something? Inquisitor. Ah, the wish is dead. Good. Here's your reward, as promised. Keep up the good work, Inquisitor. Ooh, Sia's just come online. Be careful. Right. I'll take that and we'll have a wee chat with Sia. Uh, we want to say... Guild. Uh, good afternoon. So... Yeah, uh, me and Sen, we're using the Warcraft voice chat, so I don't know what this is going to be like, whether it's it's going to be effective or not. I've got absolutely no clue. Um, right, we think we've hammered out some details. We may be able to get more than just a group of five, because Sen might be able to get more Abyssal Fragments. So we'll, we'll see about that. Anybody who's in the guild, this is mostly going to apply to you. Um, but we may be able to do two groups, uh, which is going to be even cooler. Now, Sen, I believe you had something to say, didn't you? Hello. You have to, you have, you have to speak a bit louder. Hello, What? It's nice. Who are you calling me? Frisco? Because you are Frisco. I see your name. My name is Frisco. It makes sense. Right, this is my son, by the way, who keeps calling me Frith Girl, which, I, 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 honestly, I, I'm thinking this this is terribly offensive and, and, and awful. I'm not Frith Girl, I'm Frith Gar. Gar, oh, I'm... I'm, 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 I'm just a businessman, and you are Frith Girl, everyone knows that. It's in your name, your name is Frith Girl. He's your biggest fan. Okay, right, there was something else that you wanted to do, wasn't there? Uh... Yes, do do what you wanted to do a minute, because I also have something I want to do. Uh oh. Uh huh. Oh. Go on. Hang on. You you you. There, there was Hang on a minute. What? We just uh, you wait there a second. I'm I'm waiting. I'm waiting. It was something you wanted to do, wasn't there? Uh yeah. Just hang on a minute. Um. Um. I'm hanging on. Uh. Um, I can't... Oh, yeah, I think it's like... Uh... Hang on, I can't find it. Oh, where is it? Um... Oh, there! What are you doing? 
Um, he wanted to just give you a ride. What? Yeah, come on. Yeah. Don't trust you. Come on then. I'm on. Haha, <laughs> look, we're flying! Who says that I can't fly in, um, I was going to say Drenor. This is not Drenor. <laughs> Who says that I can't fly in, um, Boralus? Look, see? You've got good view. Kaltiris. Kaltiris. There, look, see? We, we, we're, we're up above the mountains and everything. I'm right, I'm, I'm flying my mount. Good you to your death. What? No, I'm riding Maeve. I'm riding Sen. This is brilliant. <laughs> See ya. Oh, no, <laughs> 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 Not dead. Where is he? I'm floating on the parachute. They... Uh, undo your parachute. I don't yeah, think I can. No. Cheek. My parachute is gone. I'll have to bubble before I hit the ground. And <laughs> bubble. Oh. I just saw you, <laughs> you dog. Oh, you did it! Oh, oh. valid target. I, I fell down, but then I bubbled and um, I, I saved myself. Because there were lots of people were doing this, and so rather than Blizzard allowing everybody to keep doing this to each other, they now give the passenger an automatic parachute, which is just wonderful. It saves us. You should, however, fly back up into the air and try that again, because something special may happen. Something special. Something special. Very special. You you go up. I, I need to stay here this time. You you you, you go for a fly. I I'm, I got to stay here on the ground for this one. Okay. Otherwise it won't work. Okay. So, yeah. You go on up. You go on up. Yeah. Right now, sacrifice yourself to the gods. I'd Actually, not. you don't need to do that. You just you you just come back down here as quickly as you oh. can. Take it. Uh, not like that. You, you, uh, he's you, gonna prank you. Uh, Wait, you, you need you need to go back up and you need to come back down even faster than that this time. Right, we're going up. Right. Okay, now come down as fast as you possibly can. That's more like it. No. <laughs> what? Ah, I did die. What was that? Do it again. I did die. Yeah, I know, but Danny wants to shoot everyone something. Right. I, th 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 this is terrible. This is terrible. Right. Now you have to, you have to come down even right, faster than that. Here Hello. we go. Here we go. This is a proper fast descent now. And no. yes, at last. Now, you may not sacrifice yourself to the dark ones, but I can. <laughs> yes. I feel much better now. I feel much better. Okay. Sia has got issues with money management. And he laughs at me for having trouble with money management. Right, anyway, I need to go and turn in these quests. We can't stay around playing with this all day. So I will turn in these quests, and then we will see if we can pester Maeve in a little bit, or Sen. Drustfar stands firm. Drustfar stands firm. Okay. Which ending? Let us hope that this sends a message to the Coven. As long as we have weapons to fight them, we will persevere. Speaking of weapons, I believe our blacksmith has an idea on how to take down that barrier. You should have a word with him. I can do that. Well, what are we going to get? Uh, well, actually, that one's a decent upgrade, so if we go with that one. What's this? Personal seat. Uh, could be used to identify fallen villager from Corlane. We had... Um, well, there were a few of them, weren't there? Right. I don't know what to say. That you would risk your life to bring these items to me speaks greatly for your character, Mainlander. I will make sure these keepsakes make it to the friends and families of the Fallen, as well as news of their fate. On their behalf, I thank you for your compassion. The Coven is vulnerable to onions. I remember my Nan used to tell stories about them warding off evil, but I never thought to take it literally. This is quite the discovery. There, I told you, I told you right from the beginning, onions are evil, they are twisted. Onions are so dark, twisted and evil that even witches don't like them. Even witches stay away from them. They are that dark, nasty and evil. This is all the proof we need. Onions cannot ever be trusted. And when I rule the world, the first thing that we will do is eradicate all traces of onions. They are evil. I had a pizza on Friday covered in onions. 
And I assure you, it was not evil. It Kept me away from you for a long time, though, because you stank. I yeah. But he wants to do another thing. What do you want to do? Right, hang on a minute. Let me just have a look at this. Uh, ooh. Ooh, that is a very tasty upgrade. Right, we'll have that one, Mercy Salter. What? What's, when you come what's out? this? Okay, well, well right, the what's, what, what will do you want? Pay for their atrocities. Come outside. I'm outside, I'm out the front. Okay, stay there. What are you doing? I don't trust oh, this boy. Oh, oh my god! Whoa! <laughs> You said it was going to land <laughs> in the water and I'd be fine. You did land in the water and now you're fine. <laughs> See, your soul, well, your body is fine. Your soul is now mine. I have absorbed it. <laughs> Hopefully you're getting up on me. Right. Let's right. go and you, turn in his last quest. We have one more thing that we need to do because uh, my son feels that, um, well... Quite frankly, we're cheating with this whole thing that Blizzard now do, where they give us a, a, a parachute. So I have to disable my parachute, which I think is just downright mean. I, 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 I think it's I'm the dragon. No, we'll go up all the way. I don't think this is fair at all. Okay. No, no more. Go, 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 go. Long, no, 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 no. What, what are you doing? What are you planning? No, 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 no. Uh, <laughs> I got a parachute. Okay, fine. I, I've had to disable the parachute. I've also been told that for some strange reason my divine shield is no longer working. Uh, that might be because I've been sacrificing Sen to the dark gods recently. And so therefore I am no longer divine. And there we go. Now that should make you happy. Oh, dearest son of mine, you have slaughtered your own father. Do you feel pleased about this? <laughs> Someone's resurrecting people. Look at Aww. this. <laughs> this is fantastic. Someone is resurrecting people. It is awesome. You, sir, are a legend. You have a generous heart. I am going to salute him. That was awesome. There. How generous. Okay, I have thanked him and I have called him generous. Very well. We can now go. Uh, we'll we'll, do, we'll uh, finish doing this. We've got another quest over there with the blacksmith, so we have to get back to him in a minute. Hail, traveller. What? What's this? You remember the whole ring thing where uh, her beloved, her betrothed. Yeah, that, that's what this bit is. Right. This, this is the ring Alexander was to give me at our wedding. I thought it long lost. I do not know how you found this paladin, but words cannot say how grateful I am. Alexander was very dear to me, and this ring was a symbol of us of the strength of our love. It is good to feel that again. A steady tiller prevails. Oh, yes. Alexander, I wish you were here. I will always be here, dear Lucy. It's a shame. Always. It's a shame she can't hear him. Right, Lucille, he has asked me specifically not to tell you that your mother was the evil witch. Well, she wasn't technically a witch, but she was the evil one that betrayed you. I'm going to find her, and I am going to put her in a very uncomfortable place. If she's already dead, she's probably in an uncomfortable place. I'm going to kill her again, and I'm going to make her more uncomfortable, because quite frankly, I feel that was uncalled for. So, um, yes. I'm not go I'm, I'm going to unleash the fury against your mother. Do you hear me? I feel it's the I feel it's the right thing to do. Mind your tack! Oi, Grondor, and thanks again for netting me out of that coven out under the coven's boot. We nearly got a proper forge set up here, so you just holler if you need anything done. Hi, Grondor, and I think I might have a solution to that pesky barrier keeping you out of Corlane proper. I took a silver we had left here and doctored up one of these cannonballs. The walls surrounding Corlane are festooned with defensive cannons. Get one pointed at the gate. You can send this beauty right into the barrier. You'll need a hefty pinch of powder to get things moving though. It's a bit on the heavy side. You can likely find some in the camp outside the walls. Gunther and Mainlander, 
The marshal asked that you see him before you head to the camp. Something about one of his former guardsmen. One of his former guardsmen. All right, I'll go and have a look. Have a little chat. What do you want? What do you want? This, this is the bloke who's from the north that, whose accent I can never get right. Our enemy's eyes are upon us. Our enemy's eyes are upon us. It has come to my attention that you intend to assault the camp outside of the walls. If this is so, I have a request. Though most of the guardsmen who fight against us were turned to the coven against their will, Captain Goodspeed and his brigade of Halber Halberdiers gave their souls willingly to the heart's bane. They are traitors and an affront to the Waycrest Guard. You'll find Godspeed and his Goodspeed and his men stationed at the camp. I would consider it a personal favour if you would cut them down to the last. The coven will fall beneath my blade. What accent was that? What do you mean, what accent was that? I'm trying to copy Marshall Everett Reed. It's not quite, it's like, because the accents from Drustvar, they sort of hover, well, all of Kul Tiras, they, they sort of go anywhere from uh, West Country accents all the way up to Yorkshire accent. But the problem with Marshall Everett Reed right here is that his seems to fluctuate from the north all the way down to just outside of London. And so it's really it's difficult. Kind of mixed up. It is. It's kind of mixed and it's really difficult to try and imitate it because every time he speaks, his accent is different. So it's really, really tricky to try and get that one right. And I've been struggling with him since I first met him. And I don't like it. I don't He's like it at all. Out. Eh? You glad I pointed it out? Yeah, thanks for that. That makes me feel a lot more comfortable now that I've got you here sort of poking fun at me and pointing it out as well. Just just to, you know, point out all the flaws in everything I've been doing. Thanks. Much appreciated. Ooh, we got a chest. Okay, we've got to go for the chest. We got to, we'll try to ignore Sen's barbs. Vicious barbs. Bidden. Oh, great. Yeah, we got the whole crossbow things going on here. Let's take down a couple of you. And let's do it like that. There. Right, okay. If we do that, and then we give them the old shield hey-ho, and then we go with Tronsky. Super soft, plush, plushly? Pud, uh, super, super soft, cuddly, plushy toy. That's the one. Plushy toy. And uh, finish you. And uh, wait, what? Who's, who's that? Who's S Sen? Oh, that's, that's not Sen at all. There's someone else who's just wandered along behind me and has now stolen the, um... Will you... Oh, I'm, I'm facing the wrong way. Someone has just run along behind me and pinched the chest where he thought he was. He, he, he didn't stop the help, though, did he? <gasps> yes! Oh! Oh, thank goodness for that. Yes, this is what we were waiting for. The great Sea Scrolls quest. We've got it back again. Oh, we were really worried that this wasn't going to happen. Dust falls from the scroll case as you retrieve it, revealing an ornate sketching. The artwork rendered with obvious care and skill depicts a scene from a Tortolan pilgrimage. The container has spaces for 12 rolled scrolls, only one of which is occupied. A complete set would likely be quite valuable to a Tortolan collector. Collect the full set. And we will get Glowing Azurite and we get the Bartered Vrykul Warhelm. Except... Okay, we accept the quest, and then we can start building them up again. We have got right there one duplicate pilgrimage scroll. It has a max stack size of 50. They are not bind on pickup or anything of the kind, so we need to get 50 of them, and this is the only way we can get 50. So, again, I will put out the call. Anybody in the guild who is doing the Tortolan quest... Who's doing the Tortolan quest is likely to get duplicate pilgrimage scrolls. Please, 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 for the love of anything that is holy or unholy or anything in between, send them to me because we're going to need them. We are really, really going to need them. Now then, we need to find Captain Goodspeed. He's up over there. So we're going to go that way. Sen? Yeah? Are you doing the Tortolan Pilgrimage Scroll quest, the Great I Sea Scrolls? Obey. That? Yes, that. Yeah? Why do you need 50? Do you have any duplicate scrolls? That's a grey item you get. You use that one, and then you either get a scroll, oh, or um... you get a duplicate scroll, which is a grey item. 
Is it just called duplicate? Uh, let me link it in the chat for you so that you may see it also. I need to go there, like that, and then I need to go... No, not the pilgrimage scroll. That one. There. That is what it is called. Oh, I've got seven to open. Hang on. And it's it's a rolled up one. Because, uh, yeah, the, the actual pilgrimage... I've got one. Ooh. Two. I've got two. Two duplicate pilgrimage scrolls. Any of those that you get, please send them to me. Because I can I can get them. I can, like, fill out all of the quest. And then when the quest is finished and ready to turn in, I can abandon it. And I've gotten it again. But I've still got to get 50. A full stack of those is 50. So I got... And I've got one so far. <laughs> it's going to take a while to get that particular little lot. Okay, I've got a dude here. Say hi, Winston. Say hi, Winston. The Falcons of House Waycrest are the finest in all of Kaltiris. We must not let them fall to the Coven's magic. I've found where those evil witches have been tainting our Falcons. You see these, those charms? Not the motions towards the high perches and roofs nearby. They're using those to infect our flock with their evil magic as they hatch. I think Winston can get up there to take out the charms, but someone will need to direct him. I'm not quite healed up enough to take on the whole camp of Falconers. Can you help? I can do my best. We need to destroy... You sound like the guy from Jumanji. That's actually who he sounds like. Happy hunting. Happy hunting. Because... Lovely day for some witch hunting, isn't it? Yes, lovely day for some witch hunting. He does actually sound like the guy from Jumanji. Okay, I'll, I'll give you that. <gasps> Grandorn has received mail. Ooh. Right. It looks like the coven hasn't managed to enthrall all of our falcons. I can see some untainted ones still in cages in the training yard. Our falcons are well trained and should know to fly to one of our other yards if something happens to their handlers. If you can just release them from their cages, they should be able to make it to safety. Be seeing you. Be seeing you, Mr. Notley. Right. We have got a chest in there and a executioner Blackwell. Okay. Uh, but I'm not sure how to get... Uh, that's the core lane gate. I need to get through... To, uh, wait a minute. Is he around the side or is he in... I think he's actually inside. I, th I think I've got to go around there to get that dude. Yeah, I don't think that's happening. Okay, so we got to go back down this way. Inquisitor Notley is going to... Uh, I see he wants me to do the stuff in there. Wicker charms destroyed... Call Winston to help destroy the Wicker Charms. Okay, so if I stand right next to Mr. Notley here, and then call... Oh, I see. Oh, that is... That is wickedly cool. Look at this. Right. If I do that, there... Fire. <laughs> Look at him go! Okay, he is... That there, there, there is no two ways about it. He is, he is badass. Winston is badass. Right, we'll, we'll, we'll leave him there for a minute because I, I want to go in a little bit closer. We've got some wicker cages in here of stuff. Uh, falconers, more falconers. I need to falcon cage. Actually, it's just falcon cages I've got to open. There isn't, there isn't actually anything else here. Uh, well, there, there's some rather nasty witches and stuff. So let's, let's slaughter this lot. Ooh, the gun. Never forget that. <laughs> ah, yes, the gun is brilliant. I love the gun. Oh, and Tronsky. I owe you my life, mainlander. Thank uh, you. Oh, nice. I'm freeing some of these dudes, and then they're helping me. Oh, no. Who was he? He just, like, turned up. Is he a ghost? I don't quite know if he's dead or not. I don't have a target. Drustvar stands firm. Drustvar stands firm. Yeah, he, he seems like a ghost. I'm going to assume that he is a ghost. Right. I need to get have some falcon cages. Have I what? Found a friend. Yeah, he's following me around. Oh, finally. Corlane's guardsman. And I only need a few of these cages, don't I? It's five cage. Well, there's... there's some of them. Uh, but what I do need to do is we need to get you. Now, how, how do I... I don't, I don't... Oh, I see there. Right right click. And kaboom! Launch him! Oh, that is brilliant. What do you mean you it's obey? 
Don't obey. Don't obey. Don't just just for once in your life, don't do what you're told, alright? I know that you're a soldier and you're used to following orders. But these orders are not to be followed. There. Okay, right. Well, it it, it was your undoing then, wasn't it? It is unfortunate for you. Let's do that. And then we'll go up there like that. Off you go, Winston. You're the man. You're the dude. Well, technically you're not a man, you're a bird, but um, you get the idea. There is a cursed gyre falcon or something closer. up there. I'm going to get him. I'm also going to go and get that um, ore over there. That's, it's very important to me that I get that, the shiny stuff. We, we need the shiny stuff. Let's go and get the shiny. Why am I in com Who am I in combat with? This makes no sense. How am I in combat? I shouldn't be in combat. Let's throw a shield over the here. Guides my blade. And have a wee chat with these two here. And then I need to find some more of these thingies that i got to throw Winston at. Winston is probably going to get a bit upset that I keep throwing him at things. Let's just do the that and finish them off. Yes! Fight. There we go. Level 116. We are one step closer to going and getting the Abyssal Mount thingy, majiggy, cool thing. Um that we're going to do. You, up there. That's the one I'm that I want. Range. Why am I still out of range? He's right above me. Come on down. I got, it's too I, far I, I got something for you. There, look. See, feel that? And Tronsky wants to chat with you as well. I, need a I love slaughtering people with a plush, cuddly toy. It's wonderful. Super soft, plush, cuddly toy. I know where I heard that line now. I've been, I've re been repeating super soft, plush, cuddly for absolutely ages. I, I know where I heard it from. The super soft, plush, cuddly. I know where it's from. It is from um, the, the, the panda film. What is it? Uh, Kung, Kung Fu Panda. That's where it's from. It's from Kung Fu Panda. Kung Fu Panda 2, I think it is. I'm out of range. I think it's number 2. Um, the wolf. The, one of the wolves. He goes to hits. Poe, and he says, you're going to feel my fist right in your super soft, plush, cuddly face. And that's where the super Who soft, plush, cuddly me? bit comes from. And now I know. And I'm very pleased that I managed Who to figure that out. But I finally remembered it. Because uh, if, you, if you've if you not seen them, by the way, you, you should definitely go and watch the um, panda films. Kung Fu Panda. Kung Fu Panda is absolutely amazing. Right, we've got some... Wait, what are you doing? What are you lot doing? Why are you still shooting? No wonder I'm... I was wondering why my health was disappearing. My guardsman friend is over here and he's gone and died. But no apparent reason other than he's just useless. And it, I'm being shot in the back by some weird hexerald crossbowman. I, honestly, I feel this is unnecessary. And he's quite tough as well because I just shot him in the face with a blunderbuss and he didn't really blink. Okay. I feel better now. They're gone. I've, I've, I've vented that bit out. They're gone. They're done. I can grab that one. Like that. Which is all five of those. And now I just need to get Winston. Winston, you come down here and... Go. Go over there. Uh, go over there. Look, I know that this is a seafaring nation, but honestly, the whole crow's nest thing's... Right here in the, in, the, like in the middle of the mountains. It does seem a little weird. Is, is it just me or is it just... It is, it is a little weird, isn't it? I, it's not just me. It's, it's, it is. It's definitely weird. Right, there's no two ways about it. It is definitely weird. And that is what? Ooh, there's one light. There it is. I see it. We're going to go and get that and then we'll come back and we'll hand in the quest. We need, we need the shiny. Well, folks, that's all we got time for today. Even the mightiest heroes sometimes need a bit of rest. And we are far from the mightiest, so we're very, very tired. So if you've enjoyed this episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.